Michigan was the underdog as they took on Notre Dame this weekend under the lights at the Big House. Losing to Notre Dame in their season opener last year, Michigan was bound and determined to make a statement on their home turf. With constant downpour starting around 2 p.m. here in Ann Arbor, both teams had to adjust their offense due to weather. This ended in favor of the Wolverines. UM's run game played a major role in this matchup as the Wolverines totaled for 303 rushing yards. Hassan Haskins was an absolute machine on the field, totaling for 149 rushing yards, and Zach Charbonnet again proved his worth with two rushing touchdowns in the second quarter. True Wilson also had a rushing touchdown in the fourth as the Wolverines continued to rack up points. The Michigan Wolverines had an impressive 437 total yards, which was made possible by the offensive line playing what was probably their best game of the year so far. Their ability to create holes was crucial considering the majority of the game was played on the ground. The Michigan defense made the difference in the big house this weekend, holding Notre Dame to 47 rushing yards and forcing two turnovers. Sophomore linebacker Cam McGrone had 12 tackles, shutting down the Irish offense. The game ended with a victory for Michigan. The final score was 45 to 14, which bumped Michigan up in the rankings to number 14, while Notre Dame fell to number 16. Saturday night's game under the lights marks the last time that Notre Dame and Michigan will meet until 2033. Reporting from the big house, we're Wolverine women.